Picasso checks and throws. Swung on and driven. Right field. Well hit. Gone! A three-run home run for McGibbon. And Clemson has won the game. John McGibbon with a three-run walk-off home run. And there it is, guys. Clemson and South Carolina in the same regional. What do you know about that? Guess Bracketology was right. Let's go. What's up, Clemson Nation? All right, guys. The regionals have finally been announced for college baseball. They're announced at noon today. And after years of speculation and predictions of this uh, bracket happening, this regional happening, Clemson and South Carolina have finally been placed in the same regional. Clemson will be going to Columbia to play the Gamecocks. We'll be playing Coastal Carolina first, and South Carolina will be playing uh, Manhattan. And, of course, I don't know anything about Manhattan. I do know Coastal Carolina is a very good team. They've won their sixth straight conference title. They Two years ago, they were in the Super Regionals. Um, they've been in the Institute, of course, the NCAA tournament for the past numerous years and um, are always a dangerous team. They've already beat Clemson 10-7 to once this year, and I think that was the only time we played. Um, and Clemson and South Carolina, Clemson has a chance to kind of redeem itself for the College World Series a couple of years ago and everything else has a chance a chance to be the team that ends South Carolina's title run which of course would make up for the uh, the Omaha thing for me of course I'd, if that would happen I'd wish it would have been in Omaha but you know knocking South Carolina out at their stadium which is going to be a monumental task the way we've been playing lately um, would be would be great um, so we play Coastal at noon Friday. They play at four. We'll see who plays in the winner's bracket. Clemson has lost six out of their last seven, I think. South Carolina has lost five out of their last seven. These two teams are not playing good at all right now. Um, both teams' offenses have stuttered while uh, the pitching has been solid. Uh, and for Clemson, it's been, you know, pretty, pretty solid over this losing streak. I mean, we have had pitchers play a lot better than they normally do, but our offense has been just, our batting has been horrible. Uh, we've left a ton of batters in, on base, you know, stranded a ton of people. We just cannot get hits with runners in scoring position. And, um, you know, we had a chance to go, well, we had an outside chance to go to the ACC Championship. Had we played good against Georgia Tech, Georgia Tech's a really hot team. They'll be in the Florida Regional. Florida's now the number one team. Florida State's hosting. Uh, five ACC teams are hosting. Uh, but let's get back to this one. The starting pitchers for Clemson, and I don't know what order this is going to be in. I don't know who's going to start against Coastal. It'll be Daniel Gossett, Kevin Pohl, and um, Leon. So we'll see who starts against Coastal, and we'll see who starts for South Carolina. Um, if Roth will start against M Manhattan, which I, I doubt. They'll probably save him for the winner's bracket game if they make that game, which they, they should playing Manhattan. But like I said, both teams have sputtered. Um, and what a chance this is for both teams and what all, all eyes will be on this regional. Just like last year, they were on the regional with Miami and, I mean, with, yeah, Miami and Florida when they were in the same regional. And it seems like those Florida schools, the big three, always get put in the same regionals. Um, and I don't think Clemson or South Carolina, I don't know, I might be wrong on this, but I don't think they've met in the same regional since 1977 in which Clemson won that Columbia Regional. Um, so like I said guys, I'll be making another video after this this regional wraps up. If we make it to the Super Regional, which is going to be hard, we'll play probably Virginia, which would of course be another hard one. They beat us by a point in the ACC tournament. They swept us during the regular season. And this Clemson team has the potential to uh, to win. I mean, they, they've taken three out of four the last two weeks over number one Florida State. Of course, Florida State's playing, played really cold in the uh, ACC tournament, but they were playing good in the regular season when we beat them. 
So uh, South Carolina, uh, if Roth pitches against us, and uh, you know that that'll be a pitcher's duel again, maybe like the first game between Clemson and South Carolina, in which what was it? Went to extra innings one to one or something like that. South Carolina ended up winning three to two, in like eleven innings. So you know I'm looking forward to a really good regional. Of course, both our teams are playing sloppy. You know what Clemson has to do to win is continue pitching like they've pitched. Um, solid pitching, but we have to take advantage when we have runners in scoring position, and we have to just get hits, period, because we haven't even been getting many hits lately. We didn't get many hits. We left the bases loaded multiple times against multiple teams in the ACC tournament. That's something you absolutely cannot do. Um, one of the times the bases were loaded with no outs and we did not score, I believe, and that that's just unacceptable. Um, another time there was loaded with one out, double play, you know, we just cannot get those scores in guys but that's it for right now this is going to be big for everybody uh clemson is coming in looking to get this chip off their shoulder it's going to be hard but they can beat the gamecocks